Okay, so how do we take our research question and generate keywords? What we want to do is pull out the most important words from our question. So if we're interested in finding out if overweight kids are more likely to get diabetes, the one thing, one word we want to make sure we include is this term overweight, right? So we're going to add that as one of our keywords. Okay. The other one is a word that talks about the population. Who are we worried about? Who do we think is going to get overweight? Kids, right? It's another important keyword. And lastly, what are we worried they're going to get? This disease, diabetes. Now, we have to start thinking about the writers of our articles. What terms would those writers use to describe being overweight, being a kid, or getting diabetes? If you think about the databases and the kind of articles that are inside the databases, we know that they include newspaper and magazine articles, which are popular, which are written for a general audience, but that these databases also contain scholarly journal articles or research articles. Research articles use more formal language, so what we want to also do is generate terms that are formal for our keywords. So overweight looks pretty good to me, but kids, there's a more formal term for kids, which would be children. Diabetes also looks good. So now we've got three keywords, and I'll show you how you're going to combine them into a search string. The one thing I want you to notice right away is this capitalized OR. The OR is capitalized because it's a command to the search engine, and it's telling the search engine, please bring me back articles that contain the word kids or the word children. And you'll see how we put that into the um, search interface in a second. Now that we have our keywords, obesity, kids or children, diabetes, I'll show you how you can use those keywords to search in one of the library databases. In this example, I'm using Academic Search Complete. So you can see that I've added the keywords here, obesity, I have my and in caps, kids or children I have in parentheses, then I have another and in caps, and diabetes. So this is going to tell the search engine, only bring me back articles that contain obesity and diabetes and the term kids or children. There's another way that you can do this. If you click on the advanced search button instead, you can see we have ands over here on the side, and so I can split up my search like this, which might be easier. And so you can see here it's the same search again. I have obesity and then the ands are on the side, kids or children, and diabetes. Either way will work, um, but this is one way you can take the keywords that you developed earlier and use them to search our databases.